Naito Korean Toka FXB University group and today in this FXB University channel the owner technical analysis on the pair which is GBP JPY but before GBP JPY the owner some of the pairs and also through this if analysis in our elite members some of these pairs one was Euro New Zealand Eurocard card JPY gold US 30 and the other pair was GBP JPY like in GBP JPY and the only topic uh, the only pay about Taifania analysis so that Unezukadua, what do we see in the coming next two weeks or the one week? But I just want to thank you for you guys. I'm um, still in India could, could support this channel. We have been, uh, you have been subscribing, sharing our videos. Yeah, thank you. Don't forget to like and subscribe this video because when you like, you give the algorithm the YouTube so that they can share uh, this video to more, more, more viewers. Quote of the day is like, uh, plan like a genius, execute like a robot, manage risky like a casino, and manage emotions like a monkey. So, you know, always come up on a plan, which means you are planning to win. The one person that does not plan, does not plan to win. Even when they ask you, where are you going? You never see where yourself you are going, because how you plan, would you open a talk, would you open a play game? So even in trading, when you have a plan, which means you know where you are going, you know what to achieve. Always uka chepuka kutoka njia mojo kenda njia nyingine. And execution, execute like a like a robot. When you plan, which means you know when to execute. And when you know exactly when to execute, which means you know when to manage your risky. Now you will manage a risk like a casino. Manage emotions like a monkey. So this is a quote of the day guys, I don't know if you like it, but if it makes sense, hit a like button or comment down bro so that I can know if you guys do enjoy this quote of the days. Now, let's jump into the chat. Now, itanzia na pairs yambazo tulichukua na elite members. The first pair ilikuwa ni Euro New Zealand. Then at the end of the day, yeah, ilikuwa ni kuna Euro card na Euro New Zealand. Let me uh, scroll up in the... In a full mode yeah so kuna euro card i will show you kwa nini tulingia hit rate i also had the euro new zealand ambo ilikuwa an exact pain uh, a nice analysis and movement almost we capitalized uh estimated uh pipsi miambiri the manene this was my my targets lakini pia kuna so the other pair was us 30 though us 30 i kwa shared kwa elite members because I entered this almost manual from that way for capitalize around the trips. We also had cut JPY until I'm about to hold it until now, but we took the first loss in this trade because look on the NFP week. No, we had the NFP week, and always NFP week market is always crazy. So, during year trade around this level, here along the Fibonacci level, uh, which was 50%, if I'm not mistaken, then you can stop out and I stop loss, and then we entered because about. Still trade ilikuani varied. And the other pair ilikuani gold. Yes. The other one was gold or mostly entered around that level and this level. Uh, we'll see what this na uh, the coming week has for us. And the other one ilikuani GBP card. Like in GBP card ilikuwa shared in a one of our Elite member. And uh, we also I also know said combat ilikuana buying. Uh, buying entry and boil tembia kama pipsi me and then at the end of the day I quit out take a profit then cast stopped out either a break even out kama elite member uh, likuwa na jua kumanage list which means at a break even kwa sababu or it almost went into profit around pipsi me and then ika tembia but this was the actual we we cannot always be light in here to all of the trade that's why what na sisiza kumanage your uh, your risk when trading so, kabla kwa na GBP JPY analysis, ni kwanishi at least a single pair ambao tuwichi kwa na elite member. Let me choose one. I think I should choose uh, a single trade. So, let me see. Uh, the one trade ambao nisa ni kwa nishia. Maybe GBP Euro New Zealand. Yeah. Yeah, this was Euro New Zealand. Uh, Euro New Zealand. Ambao tulikap. Yeah, no, it was Euro card. Ambao tulikap. Estimated PPC mia mia stin. And Euro News, let me do on the Euro New Zealand, guys. Don't mind me, don't mind me, guys. You know the vibe. 
so let's get it now here we go uh, let me zoom it up so goja ni chukue a fresh pair a fresh pair fresh pair which is euro and zd now uh, euro is a rand yeah let me choose this commander here we go So this is Euro New Zealand, I can zoom it out in a, uh, in a nice way. Remove all of the drawings. Now, you know, to get on a funny analysis, always stands here in a higher time frame, you know. Now, always okay on a funny analysis, always okay on a higher time frame, at least in a guide, could you where the market is heading to. Come for here, but in Euro New Zealand, you could tell na he downtrend movement, and we did share around this level. And always come on a joy so my market structure. It all it akuna kuongoza kumba hey. As long as come to repata a impulse and all that. That is uh, before kuendelea na market movement all way down. Cause bob kiangali a general. This is a downtrend guys. This is a downtrend. Those kaona kuna a swing low, swing high, swing low, swing high, swing low, swing high, swing low. Now to nakuja kuta after the other swing high. So that means that kuendelea na the low. Cause babu. This law tally to require to share break, so which means you may think that the other row. So, kuna possibility ya yeah, here market kutafuta the kind of retracement anywhere ambapo in a big one and paham willi to what kitu kama hechi. We have our course and our eco shared exclusive kwenye website yetu. And all of these concepts ambazo maanyigi watu nazishare. Elite course eco planned from the uh, your course, your membership, your achievement and everything. But you, when you have your account, you can access all of your course. Eco eco planned from beginner to advanced level. Just visit our website. Link ni mekuatia kwenye description. Uh, when you visit, utaweza ku assess all these calls. Now we have to find earlier ambao whenever price ik it up, tuneza to cover the other push or way to the downside. This is how you read the price movement of summer market structure in a higher time frame. Okay? So when you daily uh kosabu to cut share on a kit kama each when ye uh when you lower time when you high time frame mobile when you weekly and then also kaona ilikuwa na hii level amba it was estimated the nice level for us to to make some entries around this level you can see vile ambapo kwa sababu target shajua inabidi jempaka huku now we need to find alias amba so here retracement itakuja kufikia so that meza tuka ya uh, tukendea na all the down the, on the downside oh through leading even the price movement, unezu can notice vile above price movement itakui na react around these levels. Sometimes the price may react in a, a constructive move or in a rejection move. Rejection move which means price is still, is rejecting the level to continue with its actual original move. But if it's not the, uh, it need a constructive move which means price is still continuing its own direction. Now can see Tal to kwa na his swing low, kwano hi up and swing low. If you know price movements, uh I hope was iki to to come beta kwepu na ku changanya, okay? Now you can see to kwa na here move on bondo swing eye, then ka form this swing low, yeah, then swing eye, then swing low. Swing high and boil break this high, now form this level. Or oh, all the way outside. Now we had to find the entry along this level. Yeah. Because Bob Daly to cut uh, to share from this entire level around here, and what we have to wait for is to use other tools. I will sum up price action from by entry ako in a BDNZ web, okay, so that we need to the good entry. I hope uh, I want to come about the concept now. This is the daily, and the daily entry our entries were to base around this level. Why? Because because break range of this structure along this level and retest along this level. Now all of our entries have to uh, to start from there. Okay. Now to kangalia kwenye lower time frame, same price. Uh, what we have to find is find a nice price movement or uh, a price action kind of formation. Uh, about to kujia kutumia exactly kama Fibonacci. About this was our first point. And this was the second point. Wajiri kupata our entry. 
so our entry almost did based on this price action and all this price action uh, unaweza kaona vile ambapo price ilita kwenye hii ambayo ilikuwa ni 50% na 60% always d na kuaga ndo entry point and negative 27 always na isn't kai to kama existing point sometimes i do use that. now this was the exact entry until around this level ambayo tuli capital estimate pips mbili mbili i'm saying okay na pio kiingia low in the lower time frame ili uh, utafute exact entry kujua when where stop loss should be likajua how vile price action itakuwa will be a nice approach ili kuepuka stop loss and so this was our exact entry point now this was euro new zealand uh, on basing on the previous pairs ambazo tulizifanyia and lakini ilikuwa a quite nice entry kwa sababu ilikuwa ni ni textbook i do call this textbook kwa sababu ukisoma tu uh, vitabu vyote huko vya forex utakuwa unaweza kuviona hizi hizi mambo ni mambo ambazo ni basic hata mtu ambaye sahi anaanza kusoma forex atakuonyesha kwamba hapa this is entry this is exit that's all okay now let's see on the analysis ya gbp jpy so that tunaweza tuka predict on the coming week how vile tunaona price moment itakuwa so let's get it so gbp jpy we actually traded this pay and uh, ni trade pay ni kangalia opportunity za kusell and we had the set and on this level on capital is missed pips in mbili and this was our targets na lakini siku ingia around this level it ingia on this level kwa sababu kulikuwepo na spikes movement nyingi during this week but the coming week will be possibly nice simply because uh, to sharp at um, exactly price movement nzuri na market condition pia nzuri okay now basing on the higher time frame let me do it all this nikuoneshe vile ambavyo general tunaona let me do it all this baby it all this it all this okay now tukianzia kwenye monthly let's start in the monthly because monthly ndo inakupa general future ya market e structure that ni kwa nisha mark uh, our potential areas basing on price movement na in a month ili unezu kaona tulikuwa na hii structure and this is the only level ambo tuliendea ku maintain and all way up lakini hii ndo kwa breakage of structure so we are waiting for the other retest kama kitu ambo chuki lifanyika around this level 80 20 na overall uptrend this is the only way you can learn how vile price movement inakuwa ina move in a higher time frame then the lower time frame confirms you what you see in the higher time frame kama ina portray in the lower time frame simply simply because kwamba ina kuonyesha what is going on on the higher time frame what are bigger boys doing in the higher time frame kwa mfano kitu kama hichi mimi nikiona price movement kama i know kwamba tutakuja kupata break movement like this though not each and every candle ambayo ita form like this one itakuwa ina portray price movement the same you have to look at the candle formation come form at what level at this level candle formation may form kwenye as a uh, potential area ambayo ni support na resistance au demand and supply area okay now in the whole time frame yeah, like a day you can see vile ambapo price movement ilikuwa ina form can see here yeah, this impasse this was the correction ambayo ili collect uzuri kabisa hii ndio ilikuwa impasse can see and this is the a correction and this correction ili tupate the other impasse move now inabidi tujue same applies impasse itakuja kushia wapi now i see the major target ambo inaweza kata ni around this level kwa sababu e level we never touch this since then price it for reject you can see so right now we are heading to where price has it to to we have to to see price moving in this manner this is what i can see so that when the lena over but kutoka huku mpaka hapa ni pips nyingi sana ukiwa kwenye lower time frame unaweza kaona vile ambavyo na candle formation in terms of uh, in terms of price movement in terms of everything uh, price action inatakia ujue vile ambavyo itakuwa ina portray so that ukapa, upate entry nzuri i know you uh, utakuwa unajua vile ambavyo jinsi ya kusoma price movement kama hujaangalia previous videos ambazo tulielekeza jinsi ya kusoma price movement go check it out cause itakufundisha kujua 
jinsi ya kufanya top down analysis mpaka kupata entry. Nielekezea all about market structure uh, movement ambazo zinakuwa zinafanyika. Na kila market uh, movement structure yote vile jinsi ya ku tools gani ambazo anatakiwa ujue vile price ambayo inakuwa ina move. I don't expect GJ uh, in this coming week kutengeneza moves ambazo uh, sio textbook. I will see textbook moves. That's all I will expect kwa sababu right now tupo na market conduce market condition ritual ziko vizuri so hatuna zile constructor market movement. So that's why saying I just want to say uh, thank you guys for watching my video and make sure you hit the like button do subscribe hit a comment down below so that tunaweza tukaendelea ku connect on the coming uh, video don't forget to share with your members don't forget to share with your uh, any member who is interested in forex trading don't forget to visit elite uh, fxb university site so that unaweza kujifunza the other sources of financial markets thank you